And I think we're all hoping that it kind of turns out like it did today because today is absolutely beautiful, Daniel. Yeah, we're looking at some pretty nice weather for this evening and then going into your Easter Sunday so you can enjoy all the activities that you may have planned for the day. Here's a look at this morning's lows and it was chilly this morning. These temperatures that you see right here is probably what it's going to feel like in the morning tomorrow. So the 40s to low to mid 50s. So if you're heading out to some services or other morning activities, you might want to keep a jacket with you. But it'll be nice and warm as we go into the afternoon. Satellite and radar featuring some very quiet conditions across our area. Here's the spin from the low that moved through our area on Thursday. That's where we saw those rain and storms. It continues to lift off toward the northeast and so some dry days for us. So there is some rain off toward the west, but all of this is being carried up toward the north. So we're not seeing that south dive that we normally see with some cold fronts, but I do anticipate our next front arriving by Thursday. So we have some nice days to enjoy. No rain chances through the middle part of the week. And of course, your Easter forecast looking pretty good. Again, that cool start with temperatures in the mid 50s. An excellent day by the afternoon. Highs in the upper 70s to near 80 degrees. And continuing for dinner, looking at some pretty nice conditions. Let's talk about our next rain chance. I think it arrives on Thursday. Long range models showing cloud cover building back in on Wednesday. Maybe a few sprinkles Wednesday evening. But the bigger rain threat arrives on Thursday, anticipating some severe weather possible across parts of South Texas. As it lifts into our area, some rain and a few thunderstorms is what I'm seeing right now. If that continues to intensify, we'll keep you updated on that forecast. But looking at a soggy afternoon and early evening on Thursday, this model showing the rainfall moving out pretty quickly and a pretty enjoyable weekend. But other models making that rainfall move a little bit slower. So we could see some lingering rainfall on the Friday and Saturday. But of course, long way away. We'll continue to monitor that forecast for you. 74 degrees, the high temperature today at the Kenner Airport. The record was 90. Thankfully, no 90s for us over the next seven days, but we were comfortable in the low to the mid 70s. Right now, that's what we're seeing our temperatures right now where our highs were today. And from 24 hours ago, many areas a good 10 degrees or warmer. We're seeing those temperatures in the morning again in the 40s to low 50s on both sides of the lake. And over the next several days, that warming trend is going to continue as winds shift back toward the south, brings in a little bit more of that humidity and allows those temperatures to go up a few more degrees into the low 80s as we progress toward Wednesday of next week. But get out and enjoy this beautiful weather, clear sky for us this evening. Overnight, we'll keep the chilly temperatures with the winds shifting back toward the south as we go overnight and into your Easter morning. But overall, a pretty beautiful day for you with those winds out of the southeast, 5 to 10 miles per hour. Dry days through about Wednesday. That's when we start to see some rain chances creeping back into the forecast Thursday and Friday, but keeping those mild temperatures through the week.